Welcome back guys for another video. Today what we're going to talk about is the hybrid form of Dragon Fruit Rework in Block Suit. So without further ado, let's talk about it in today's video. By the way guys, we just recently reached 80,000 subscribers and we are going to be doing a permanent fruit giveaway thanks to reaching 80,000 subscribers and first and foremost I want to say a thank you from the bottom of my heart to everybody that subscribed to the channel and I highly appreciate it because our goal is to reach 100,000 subscribers before June 30, 2024 and you subscribing will help me reach that goal so please don't forget to like and subscribe and along the way we're gonna do a ton of permanent food giveaways, dark wave giveaways and all those other stuff so if you want to win these stuff all you have to do is subscribe you could be the next permanent food winner. Now right, first and foremost let's talk about the hybrid form so a lot of people have been talking about this hybrid form for a long time now like myself included i've been talking about the hybrid form and i really do want to see a hybrid form get added for the dragon fruit because like i said previously if the dragon if the hybrid form isn't gonna get added in this rework i doubt that it's gonna be added ever again so i'm very thankful that it's most likely going to be added and there's a couple of proofs and the biggest proof that there's going to be a hybrid form is going to be at the end of this video Okay, first and foremost, if you go check out Rip Indra's Twitter account here, you will see that on his latest sneak, on his latest um, sneak peek right here, you will see that the dragon fruit does have a tail. So, T-Rex also has a dinosaur tail, and I know that T-Rex also has a dinosaur tail. If you go check this sneak right here, the end of the tail has a hair, and even the tail has hair. So, if you go zoom in very close to right here, I can zoom it in. Um, but there's hairs over there. There's a lot of hairs over there and it's just bigger in my from looking at it It looks bigger and thicker compared to the t-rex tail uh, again Let's take a look at the tail right here. The tail right here looks just significantly smaller and different in sh shape and size Compared to what yeah, as you guys can see right here if you go take a look at the sides and stuff like that it looks considerably different from what was shown in Rip Inja's newest sneak peek. So it looks considerably different. Here's, I think, a better shot of it. You will see that the T-Rex tail is just very, very different from, from what we've got on Rip Inja's sneak peek. So this is going to be the last look I'm going to give you guys. But yeah, it's very different. A lot of people might say it's the same thing. But um, personally, I think it's very, very, very different. And yeah, if you take a look at Kaido right here, a lot of people are taking are saying maybe a hybrid form and yet yeah, Kaido does have a tail in this form, but tail that they're talking about looks very different here. And a lot of people are saying, hey, this is an enhanced picture by, um, this is an enhanced picture by, I believe, Chashir A uh, for 10 Roblox. If you take a look at the tail here, it just looks significantly different compared to what the T-Rex tail is. Very, very, very different. But the number one thing that I'm seeing right here is the Fury Meter. The Fury Meter right here, there's more than one Fury Meter, which means that maybe, just maybe, like I already talked about this in the past, for example, let's actually go show you guys that again. All right, so here for Kitsune, for example, for Kitsune, the tails um, multiply as my Fury Meter, or sorry, my tail bar goes up. So I do think that that's the same for kids for dragon right here. Um, I do think that the tail for dragon will show up as you increase your fury meter. So for example, maybe once you have max fury meter, you're gonna have the hybrid transformation. But before we continue talking about dragon fruit rework, what is the point if you can't even get dragon fruit rework because it's too expensive? It's five thousand robux and it's also going to be very high value. What's the point of the update if you can't even get the fruit you want? Well, that's where the sponsor of today's video is gonna help you out with. So let me introduce you to Kinjo. Kinjo is an app where you can play the best quality Roblox games to help you build skills that will make you a better gamer. No more flames, no more Kinjo coins to earn, earn enough Kinjo coins and you can redeem them for real life Robux. Sign up and earn Robux while playing your favorite games like Blox Foods and Hay Space and make sure to use my referral code KM4DJH when signing up to earn 300 Kinjo coins for free. And once you sign up, share my referral code with your friends so you all get extra Kinjo coins. And the best part, we will also be doing a permanent fruit giveaway for everyone that uses my referral code when signing up on Kinjo. Download Kinjo now in the pinned comment and description to earn Robux while playing games and having fun. Sign up now on Kinjo because I'm sure you're gonna need it for the update.
you can join I, our official partners now. So if you want to be part of an extra permanent food giveaway, all you have to do is enter my referral code KM4DJH onto Kinjo app. And you guys are going to be entered into a permanent food giveaway on my Discord. So if you want to be part of two permanent food giveaways, subscribe and enter my referral code. Here you guys have it. This is the biggest piece of information we have that there is going to be a hybrid transformation. Let me just turn off my face cam right here. So here, um, you, guys, you guys can clearly see that this is made by Gamer Robot. So I don't really know if this is legit because it was sent to me by a guy named Pro Capybara on Discord. So I don't really know if this is super legit or not. But from the looks of it, it does look legit. Gamer Robot Incorporated right here. Dragon Hybrid Transformation looks pretty real in my opinion, and yeah, yeah it looks pretty real. However, um, this looks, us, us, this looks insane. So I think this is Ken Roblox work, because if um, you go check the, the shirt, it says Ken Roblox, and it does look like Ken Roblox shirt as well. So I'm not really too sure how legit this is, but um, there's a high, but with this, um, I think what game Ro what the Ken Roblox does is it basically takes the animations from from the game files of other the uh, of other developers and stuff like that. I think that's what he does, and then puts it on his inventory or puts it on himself. Now it appears that this is from Ken Roblox, and there's a hi dragon hybrid transformation right here. But yeah, um, that's pretty much the biggest information he got on a dragon uh, on a hybrid form. However, apart from that, the other big thing is the tail, which like I already mentioned, doesn't really look like a T-Rex tail anymore. It looks more like a dragon tail. Or maybe there's gonna be a new fruit again. Maybe there's gonna be a new fruit because of this, drag this dragon. Or maybe it's gonna be an accessory. Maybe dragon tail accessory or something like that. that that's, that's very possible as well. Also, he doesn't really have a wings here, so maybe it's just the tail. Um, yeah, maybe yeah, maybe it's just a tail because the the hybrid form of of Kaido doesn't really have a tail, anyways. So that's looks pretty good. There's a lot of stuff gonna get added in this update, and um, like I already mentioned in the, the previous video, I mentioned that there might be an awakening for the Dragon Fruit rework. I mentioned that there might be an awakening, a very possible awakening, because of the Dragon Boss Room leaks that we have. And I mentioned that it's very possible that there's going to be an awakening. Maybe this hybrid transformation is going to be part of that awakening. Or maybe it's going to be part of the dragon fruit, like right out, out of the box, like right out of the box or right off the bat. Maybe it's already going to be part of the dragon fruit. However, if there's going to be an awakening, it's very possible that it's going to be part of the awakening as well. And yeah, um, shout out to Pro Cop Ibarra and maybe Ken Robux as well, because I do believe this image did come from him. Um, which, but which is why I'm not too sure of how legit it is because, um, yeah. But however, I think it's legit still because what Ken Robux does is he just takes the inventory items of other people and then, you know, just edits it and stuff like that. This probably just came from the game files of Game Robot and then he just took it and put his character there. And yeah, um, this looks pretty good. Anyways, that's gonna be it for today's video, guys. Dragon Fruit Hybrid Transformation is getting more and more likely as the passing days go by. And that's gonna be it for today's video. I'll see you guys in the next one. Peace out, everybody. Don't forget to like and subscribe.